Would. Well, I think it's both parts, though. I think he's he's kind of you kind of rationalize it like, ah, good, I'm free. Mm. This opens up a whole so many possibilities. But, but and I'm then not in the back of your mind, you're like, like his, yeah. his from the from the from the two million. No, I'm no, just talking, I'm, I know okay, what you before mean. he got fired. I'm just saying, it, the guy was doing something that's unheard of. And and look, man, like Les Moonves, man, he's a boss, boss. He's these guys. If this was the mob, dude, yeah, that's yeah. how you that's the Don. look at it. Where's Chuck Lorre in the mob? Is he a capo? Is he a boss? These guys, yeah. they don't give a fuck. You're meat. Two million dollars a week yeah. and shit. They offered Seinfeld five million yep. a yeah. week. Then that was ten, what, ten years yeah, ago? Yeah, probably ten, right? Do, he no. do, he's a, he, that means if they offered him five, he was probably worth a billion to them. But to add to your discussion, let's move yeah, as... It's, Paid Charlie a visit, was in his kitchen. This is documented and said, Look, man, just fucking, you know, back off a little bit. Let, reel it in a little bit. Because they, un they both understood. Think of it like it's a mob. He's the, like, the Back boss. off. All, he goes, All I need you to do is back off a little. I know what you're all about. I don't need you sober and all that shit. I just need you to back the fuck off a little. And he Charlie, people off. And Charlie chose not to. But, 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 but that's, that's was, what at we that know. At that point, there was still a chance. Yeah. That's, what we, that's what we were told. That's what we know. Yeah, you're right about the that. Fucking, you're right about that. If, yeah. if, if you heard a story that fucking uh, uh, Mel Carmison came and visited Anthony at his house, and it was just like, he goes, hey, Anthony, like, that guy is the guy. So he comes to you. It, it's not. It's not a fucking request. But he didn't. He, he didn't <laughs> yeah. fuck with Les, though. He didn't fuck with Sumner, and he didn't fuck with Les. He's not a dumb. You're right. He was raised in this business, but he also knows how that far he could. Sumner paid. will fucking will dump Cruz. He will dump Charlie Sheen. Sumner yeah. will fire anybody because he's ninety and he doesn't give a fuck. And he's yeah, a billionaire. Yeah, yeah. He felt yeah. like he knew how far he could take. He it. felt like he could fuck and with that's Chuck Lorre. Change. Maybe it is because of the drugs and the lack yeah. of sleep, yeah. and then his perception was off. And then, he but he, but he was always that. And it was the number one show yeah. on yeah, TV. Yeah, yeah. What are they going to do now? This is why this game is is um it's 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 a gangster business. I, it, when we talk shit about the bridges, I look my I try to keep my head low. I do. I try to be old, crazy, fat man and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not yeah. trying to really know what's going on, dude. Because people ask you to do things and they tell you to do things. Once you do, once you do it, <laughs> it's like the mom. It's the mom. Hey, do, hey, Patrice, do me a favor. Listen, we're gonna let you win an Oscar if you just do this. And you go, yeah. So if you're an avarice person and you want it all, yeah. But I like, I, I, I like the, under, un, more under the radar. Like somehow, kind of. Banano is still lived to be a ripe old age. <laughs> somehow, who's the other the other boss that lived to be a ripe old age? Uh, um, oh, a fucking the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the one who they thought was crazy, but it wasn't. Yeah, the yeah. Carlo, no, no, no. The, the, the boss, boss. The, yeah, yeah, Carlo, not, not Carlo, the, the one in the, uh, Vincent the Chin. Gigante. No, not oh. the Chin too, but Gigante, but, yeah. but the the boss of the really the boss. Paul boss. Castellano. Who was shot? For, the, for that family. The guy walking around in the that bathroom? Was oh, the old one, Carlo the, Gambino. Gambino lives oh, okay. to be, like, to figure out how to live to be a ripe old age in this game is the same thing. I look at this game like it's the mob, man. I'm tell it's it scary. is a good way to look at I it. I just stay yeah, as a yeah. combo and okay. just go put in some work and, I'm and an back earner. off. I'm a good earner. But here's, who Char okay, here's a, a great earner. example. Charlie was Joe Good. Pesci. He's a made man. Lori was the Jewish guy, Ace Rothstein. Who he thought, I'm a made man, I'm better than him. And I'm going to tell you something, Ace Rothstein fucking earned. And they didn't give a fuck. They didn't kill would, him. You cannot that's kill true. Ace. That's he true. wanted to fucking whack that's Ace, true. and he couldn't. And that's what this was. Chuck, Because Chuck Lorre has fucking... Because Charlie that, Sheen is a Puerto Rican he's got, when, it, when it's all boiled down to Mike it. and Molly, and he's got... <laughs> He's got three. He's got three hit shows. The three biggest. Oh, three out to knock that shows. guy out. Who's, got, Chuck, who's Chuck? What's his other show? Fucking uh, just uh, Mike Bang, and Molly, Big, Big Bang, Bang, Mike and Molly, and, and How I Met. Chuck Lorre. Those are Chuck Lorre. Yes. yes. Yeah. Well, Charlie Sheen is somewhere in this, this fucking. Charlie, I think Charlie he's, fucked he's up. Somewhere in a freezer, hanging up by the back. He's got four. Leg. He's got I'm four gone. hit shows. Yeah, I think he just made TV. a bad move, dude. He allowed his craziness. You're not gonna knock that guy out ever. It's Especially since Charlie was being unpredictable. It was like, if we let him stay and he keeps going, what if he self-destructs? And what if a girl overdoses at his house? Like, then they start thinking that way. What if a girl fucking dies in his house doing coke? Then we have a public relations nightmare because everybody's like, you saw it coming, you saw it coming. They let him go. If he would have just pulled fucking back and talked to them off the air and said, mm -hmm. look, 
I've been a little crazy. Fuck it. He would have mm-hmm. been fine. Mm-hmm. That's my opinion. Jesus. Uh, yeah, he also created Grace Under Fire, Sybil, and Dharma and Greg. The guy makes and, a lot and, of money and for the networks, And where are man. all they? They're, yeah. <laughs> where yeah. the fuck? And uh, you, heard, yeah, he, you heard Grace Under Fire. What's that bitch's name? Uh, Brett Butler. You heard she was yeah. trouble. Yeah. You we, ain't going to see them no more. <laughs> we don't see them. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Yep. Yes, sir, boss. Yeah, yeah, that's Those it. Those shows were pretty fucking successful. This guy's had a nice run. You get your knuckles dirty. That's what you do. You either get mm. your knuckles dirty or you try to move up in the game. Damn, man. And it's either sunny black or sunny red. <laughs> You're going <laughs> to <laughs> fucking Chuck Lorre's the cracker, nigga. And it's, 